So welcome back. Today I just wanted to show you a super easy way to build this digital clock that has not been discussed by anyone yet. You just need only two components to build it. Any of the ESP8266 based board and a super cheap TM1637 four digit seven segment display and four female to female DuPont wires. That's it, nothing else. So without any further delay, let's get started. Let's make the connections first. Super easy, isn't it? Now connect the ESP8266 board to your computer. Open Tesmotizer. Click Refresh to select COM port, then select Release and select Tasmota display dot bin and finally click Tasmotize. Now go to your Wi-Fi settings and connect to a newly discovered Tasmota device network. Select or enter your Wi-Fi network here and enter its password. Note this IP address. In a few seconds, your ESP will connect to your router and you will soon see the Tasmota dashboard. Alternatively, you can go to the noted IP address for the same. Click Configuration and Configure Module. Set the module type to Generic 18 and hit Save. Again click Configuration and Configure Module. Select D3 as TM1637CLK and D4 as TM1637DIO. You can also select any free GPIO pins of your choice. After restart, you will see a button on Tasmota dashboard. If you turn on the button, the display will show the current time. If it is showing the wrong time, you need to set your correct time zone in the console. Go to console and set the right time zone by typing time zone and the time zone of your area, say plus 530. And now you will see the correct time on your display. But still, it doesn't look like a clock, right? For that, you first need to enter three more commands in console. Enter display model 15. Then enter display mode 0. And finally, display clock 1 for 12 hour format or display clock 2 for 24 hours format. And that's it. And now you have a digital clock that can auto sync the correct time from the internet every time you turn it on. But wait a minute, there is a problem. If you interrupt the power to your clock, it doesn't show the time as the display stays blank. The solution is very simple. We need to create a rule here to turn on the clock automatically upon each boot up. For that, type rule 1 on system hash boot do display clock 1 1 and on. And turn on this rule by typing rule 1 1. And from now on, whenever the power is resumed, 
the clock will still display the correct time. So this was the basic and the super simple to build DIY digital clock. If I get good response on this video, soon I'll come up with its advanced version also. So don't forget to like and share this project. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, do it now as it is mandatory. Yes, you heard it right. It is definitely mandatory to get all future unique and practical videos as and when I'll post them. So stay connected and we will meet in the next video soon. Until then, goodbye friends.